Hello, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to do a collective reading for Aries. So let's hop right into it. This will resonate if your sun, moon, or rising sign is Aries. Hope everyone's doing amazing today. So let's start and get some tarot. Do a shuffle and then pull a few cards. And then we'll do some, ooh, the star first card out. Beautiful. People really see you as the star, someone who's really got their life together. You could feel like you've got options going on right now. Not sure if all of them are ones you can trust. So you're focused on your pentacles. You've got a lot of passion for life and your projects that you're currently focused on. Just saw the Knight of Cups as well. So you could have a love offer coming in from a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Um, it was in reverse though. So it looks like something you could be rejecting at the moment. Yeah, so we've got the lovers in reverse. So just feeling in disarray, maybe disconnected from the person you are trying to connect with. Maybe just feeling like the two of you are on different pages. Feeling like you can't um, seem to meet in the middle. Maybe one of you wants a commitment, the other doesn't. Looks like the two of you could build a solid foundation together, but currently it's like one or both of you just is almost untrusting of the other or is working on like their coins. So they're just not really worried about love. We've got the king of wands in reverse so this could be you aries regardless of gender you could feel like you don't have any love to offer any anyone else at the moment you're kind of focused on your own passion wow though we've got an increase of the wands there so it looks like you will be meeting someone who definitely sparks your interest to say the least it looks like where you were previously feeling stuck um things are going to change like if you wanted to leave a certain situation, you'll no longer feel that way or vice versa. Could be the opposite energy. Absolutely beautiful. So for energies we have on the board um, with the star, we've got Leo and then, or sorry, Aquarius. And then with the Hierophant, we've got Taurus with all the cup energy. We've got Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, lots of fire energy as well. And we've also got Gemini and Cancer here. So you could be dealing with any of those signs currently or coming up. Let's see if we get any random messages here to add to the story. I feel it looks like it's you that's focused on doing your own thing. Um, so some of you could have previously or been dealing with a karmic masculine. You could be currently... Some of you are about to receive some unexpected finances. And it says, I wish I could tell you how sorry I am. So that could be someone from your past. The bottom, we've got twin flames there. So you could be dealing with a twin flame connection or were previously. And we've got workplace romance. So it could be someone you met through work. could be something on the side um, maybe you or this person it says let your light shine you crazy diamond and last one we have underneath says time to move wow and new relationship so for some of you it looks like in the past you were dealing with a karmic relationship and essentially spirit is telling you if you've been guided to walk away from it or you already did it was in your best interest you are being led to your twin flame if you aren't currently with this person. Looks like this past person's sorry, but it's almost saying time to move or like time to move forward. Then we've got I made a huge mistake. So this could be someone from your past. Uh, maybe coming forward to say that they regret something they did or a decision they made. Maybe they ghosted you or were with someone else. Wow, twin flames again, as if. So double twin flame confirmation there. You are definitely either in union with a twin flame or about to meet one. So absolutely beautiful energy there for you, Aries. 
Let's see if we can get some love messages from the person on your mind or your person. Whoa, and we just literally had so many fall. Um, so a couple remained here. It says, since you left, I lost a part of me. Then we've got, they're stuck together. I love you to the moon and back. So this person has a lot of love for you. And it says, you are the better half of my heart. My soulmate, my one true love now and always, I love you. Wow. So for some of you, it looks like you could be dealing with a soulmate connection and also a twin flame connection. And if not, it's like the two of you have such an intense bond that this person maybe are unaware of what twin flames are and the fact that you two share that connection. And last message here, Aries, it says, I love everything about you, especially your body. So this person's very attracted to you physically and just emotionally. It's like you fulfill them in a sense. They're very attracted to you um, on the outside and on the inside. So that's really beautiful messages to see. It's almost like they're saying you're the better half of them there. And you really complete them in a way. So really beautiful energy. It looks like for you in the future, you could either be starting a new romance or deciding to mend one. And for others of you, you could just continue to work on yourself. And that's when this new relationship is going to come in. And for some of you, it's going to be after some unexpected pentacles, some sort of gain, um, unexpected finances from you. Of course, Aries are always so hardworking. So you're probably putting in the hard work to get there. So absolutely beautiful to see. I feel like Spirit's really just telling you at this time to make sure you let your light shine don't be afraid to stand out be different be unique and truly be you for some of you maybe you felt like you weren't always accepted if you were different but spirit's saying don't be afraid to be like unapologetically you that's what really makes you shine and overall people are just drawn to you at this moment it looks like you're working on something and you have a lot of potential for new love coming in and even like past love offers returning so let's see if we can get one more message there to conclude the reading. If your person or the person on your mind could say anything to you, what would they say? This is for Aries. Go ahead, spirits. Okay. We're just going to take the top one. It says, I do not fear struggle anymore because I know with you by my side, we can overcome anything together. I love you. Wow, so beautiful message from your person there. They've got a lot of love and respect for you. And maybe in the past, before the two of you came together or since you have, you've just shown them the, this confidence in life and maybe like this rejuvenation and understanding that through love, like they can truly be happy again and really go after their dreams. And I feel like they find this inspiration within you. They're definitely super attracted to you. They love everything about you, um, especially maybe your physique. You could be someone who's super in shape or just super attractive. There's something about you that they're just like captivated by. So that's really beautiful energy to see. Looks like for some of you, this is definitely love. And for a lot of you, this is definitely a twin flame connection. So we're going to leave that there. I really hope that resonated for you today. And I hope you have an amazing day. Until next time, take care.